talking about headliner. You, you were a star defensive lineman. Uh, That's old, man. <laughs> uh, so, uh, do you see the potential in some of these guys? Uh, you know, you, you become a star by making plays and, and right. you know making an impact on the game. Do you see that potential? In well, some the of these potential guys? I see is we're only as good as we all if we're all together. And it, it, we don't have a guy that's just a single out guy. I don't see one. We don't. We're not there. Um, we're we're a good defense together. And and when we're we okay, when we do that, somebody's gonna come out of the pack. And <coughs> everyone will see. But let's just stay together and and just keep learning and learning the system, playing together, and, and and go through camp doing it all correctly and and get ready for the game. And then somewhere. If it's not somewhere in November, we'll know who that guy is. If you were uh, to poll fans, I, I would uh, say they would probably say a potential star on the defensive line would be Ray Drew. You know, five-star prospect, six sacks last year. Uh, yet, right, you know, you see him running with the threes right now. What what is it that you see in Ray, and what is it that you don't see in him right now? That's you know, Ray's doing like, good, is it? So, fans. Hey, fans can make all that's fine. That's part of the game. Great. Right. I'm glad the fans think that way. Come coach them. Mm-hmm. Come coach them. Come stand in the heat. <laughs> and when then we'll make a decision. And but other than that, everyone is working. And um, I'm more concerned about us playing together. I'm not worried about, you know, where they are now. Where if he's a two, is he all I know, he's working. And it's not where you locate, is it's what you're doing to make us say, okay, maybe. Okay, we're getting better. But if we're caught up on where you are on the depth chart, I mean, you, there's plenty of guys in NFL camps at the bottom of the depth chart in the NFL. What are they doing? Working. So that's what we're doing here. Well, the guys get themselves in the shape you were talking about. I'm, 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 well, I'm very proud about the, 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 the shape. They, you know, they lost a lot of weight, and it was something It starts in the weight room. But it also starts with the individual to change his body, and I think that brought a little, a lot more confidence to them among themselves that they did something by themselves instead of someone actually. Or you know, it starts with the strength and conditioning program, but it's something they did over the summer instead of waiting now mm-hmm. to do it now. You can't right now. They're more focused. They're not. They're not surviving. They're, they're practicing football, so that's what's been enjoyable. Coach Brewer was talking the other day about wanting to find a three-down nose tackle. Do you think there's somebody on this roster that can do that? I don't know. You have to ask Coach Brewer. I'm, man, I'm about low out. I don't know. <laughs> they all going to have to play, you know, a three-down nose. I mean, I, I don't – it's so early, and this will be the first day of putting on full pass, and I think we'll know who they are. But to find – we want this, we want that. All I can do is right now, let's work what we got, see if we can get them – and we're going to put the best players on the field at the best time. So all we're trying to do is learn the system, get lined up correctly, and just, just let's do it right.